And then we measure muscle testing outcomes to see what the patient requires um, as far as the therapy. So we're doing different types of sensory receptor challenges and finding out what, what normalizes those challenges or blocks those challenges towards a more normal state that guides our therapy. So we're doing little scientific experiments every time we do a sensory receptor based diagnostic challenge and a muscle test, we're sort of t challenging hypothesis. Is bleach sniff positive? Is there a free radical problem? Yes or no? Muscle testing response. Did a little scientific experiment. Go on. Is ammonia sniff positive? Yes or no? Did a little scientific experiment. And we, based on what we find, we go to the next step. If bleach sniffs positive, then we test taurine. Is another scientific experiment. Is taurine negated? Yes, no. So we're doing these little hypotheses and, and uh, clinical procedures of scientific investigation. And it's a very scientific way of practicing. Instead of just giving something and waiting through to see if the patient gets better, we're testing step by step along the way and um, <clears throat> using muscle testing outcomes as our, as our clinical tool of evaluation. It's a, the thought process is scientific. Now, it's not scientifically rigorous like a research project, but the process, the thought process is science. That's what we do with AK. Uh, 